What is going on, everybody? It is the Misfit Bear, and, uh, it's been a week, but I'm back. Being a Texas-dwelling individual, we were just hit with a very powerful winter storm, and we were without power for four days. Our water, the pipes, kept going strong, but, uh, yeah, it was cold. But we survived, and everything is all good. And I'm back with another reaction. I didn't get around to watching the Blizz, you know, con line thing. But as soon as I saw that they talked about Diablo, Diablo 4 even, I had to just sit down at almost 1 in the morning and... Just decide to react to the whole Diablo presentation from the BlizzCon 2021 live stream that they did today. It's not long, it's maybe 13 minutes, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed that they're going to release Diablo 4 soon. I'm so ready for that game. I cannot wait. I am so excited, and I'm excited to see what this video has to offer. So uh sit back. Get your headphones and uh, let's get right on into it. There he is. There he is. There he is. And there she is. Hey, everyone. Thank you very much for joining us. Yes. I am so excited to kick off the Diablo segment of our show. And I am honored to be here on behalf of all of our Diablo teams to share the news and updates we have in store for you today. Yes, We've got fill a me lot in. Of Diablo to cover, and I hope you'll agree with me that it's a great time to be a member of this community. All right, let's kick things off with Diablo 4. We first shared our game with you during BlizzCon of 2019. Yes. And we've been truly humbled by your response. Yes. We've kept in touch. My response with quarterly was updates. And oh, I loved it. Appreciate the thoughts. I can't and wait. The feedback you've provided as we unveil more and more of the game and share in its development. After all, Diablo belongs to you as much as it belongs to us. Aww. Most recently, we teased an update to our campfire screen, and savvy fans, of course, understood that we meant more than just the character lighting and fire visual effects. That's right. Today, we're huh? happy to announce a brave new soul joining the Barbarian, the Sorcerer, and oh? the Druid on this dangerous journey back to Sanctuary. Which class? Class is one of the most exciting things you can announce in a Diablo game. This one is especially exciting to me as it's a re-envisioning of one of the first classes to ever appear in the series. Wait. Let's have a look. Wait, hold on. I'm getting flashbacks from when I did research on this from one of my previous videos. Oh, it can't be. Hold on. There is justice within the light. But you have to be patient. It can't be. Now. Templar? Pray with me. May Akarat guide and protect me. May Akarat guide and protect me. No, it's not. May he shepherd my soul. May he shepherd my soul. Maybe? And grant it mercy. And grant it mercy. It's the but fucking I'm rogue! Here. This is not the time. But this is confession. It's the rogue! And I have sinned. Oh my god! who stole from those more fortunate. Oh my god, it's the rogue! I strayed from your light. It's the rogue! In the shadows. Oh, and she's gonna be dagger and bow! Murder. That was a prediction I made! Job well done. That was a prediction I made! Oh my god! Enough! 
I am a thief. A heretic. A murderer. Father. Oh my god! Will Akira save me? Hmm. You mock our light. But those monsters were a scourge upon my flock. Oh my gosh! And you... I'm so ready! Oh, you were the answer to their prayers. Then we are settled. And you owe me. The name you see is... Of course! Thank the heavens. Of course! Heavens? Whoa! I assure you, Father. The heavens didn't send me. Oh, that must have been one of her ears! Yes! Let me see that sweet gameplay! Dual wielder after my own... you see how clean that was? You can just switch between melee and ranged on the fly! Oh my gosh! You can throw down cow drops. You can just dash through. That's what the monk did! That freaking dashing is what the monk did! Oh my god! Oh snap! Oh snap! Oh! Whoa, that's a crooked priest! <laughs> it's the sound of that ear getting pierced by the hook is so brutal. Yes! I feel like it's gonna haunt me for a long time. Well, I've it's been not me. I've been a fan of the rogue ever since the original Diablo. Even seeing them come back as NPCs and mercenaries. Oh in my God! Served us a great bridge between the games. With the setting of Diablo 4 being a larger world than we've ever played in before. Yeah, it's gonna be excited it's to gonna be great. Not just what the successors to the original rogues in the series have been up to since the fall of their order, but also what some of the other rogues in the world of Sanctuary might look like. The mantra for Diablo 4 has been customization first. Yes. And the rogue I love takes that. It to a whole new level. From the beginning. The rogue has been an incredibly flexible. Oh, that to is adapt dope. To any situation. Our goal is to let you create the kind of rogue that you want to play. Whether it's an unrivaled archer modeled after the original sisterhood or a nice. dagger rogue from the darkest alleys of nice. Aldea. In Diablo 4, you will have the freedom to create the rogue that you imagine by customizing the looks the background and the playstyle of your character. What? Please stick around for our segment later today, where I'll be joined by other members of the Diablo 4 team to share a closer look at the Rogue class, as well as some of the open world gameplay that we're bringing to the game. Oh yes, Spoilers, I wanna see that. Those years are not just for show. But Diablo 4 mm, is not the mobile the game. Diablo game we're talking about today. Yeah, the mobile game. If you're looking for an authentic Diablo experience on mobile. I never really thought about comfort. it much, but I sure as hell Diablo will look Immortal at it. Has everything you'd expect from a triple A action RPG. From the visceral combat and epic Ooh. loot to an all new story, bridging the gap between the events of Diablo 2 and Diablo 3. Really? Later today, you can join the Immortal team where they'll talk about some of the things they've learned from their recent alpha test and what's next for the game. But that's Interesting. still not all. We have one last bit of very exciting Diablo news to cover. When you hear us talk about the classes, the items, or the stories right? of the early Diablo games, you may have picked up on the absolute reverent tone we reserve for that golden era of Diablo. Maybe you share that love of the classics, and just hearing us talk about them makes you want to take on Mephisto or Bale one more time. Diablo 2? For the first time. 
After all, some of our favorite moments happened a long time ago, and not just in sanctuary years. I... If so, we have a special surprise for you today. No. Let's check it out. No. You did not go there. They are remaking Diablo 2. Lord of Terror. Oh my god, they're remaking Diablo 2. Yo! I never, like, owned it, but I have played it. Not very much, but I have played it. Oh, it's being remastered! Yo! Oh my gosh, this is gonna make so many people happy. People would have preferred this over Diablo 3. No bullshit. Man! Oh my gosh, dude. Wow! It looks so good! Like they did an and console? With cross progression. I guess that means that you won't have to start over on both uh, the, the Druid. I guess that means you won't have to start over if you decide to get uh, the game on two different uh, two different platforms. I, I can't even talk right now. And it's coming out this year. On the Switch too? Man, that's dedication. After more than 20 years, 20 the Dark years Wanderer has returned. Wow! Once again, he travels east, always east. That Diablo is II nuts. Is a landmark game for Blizzard. Diablo 2 Resurrected is a full HD remaster of both the original game and the expansion Lord of Destruction. I'm getting it. It takes the 2D sprite-based classic that we love. I'm getting it. Brings it into the present in 3D, utilizing up-to-date graphical rendering and lighting technologies. I'm playing it on the channel. Also includes modernizing all 27 minutes of cinematics, recreated shot for shot with the explicit intention of preserving both the look and the pacing of the original movies. Wow. Blizzard has a long history of games that we're proud of. And when we think about Diablo 2, we think about it as a definitive pillar. Oh, yeah. Now, it's funny to think that some of you weren't even born when D2 was released, which makes it all the more important that we deliver an authentic experience. Yeah. Wherever you A play. whole lot of people don't even know we about want it. everyone to relive their memories or experience the game for the very first time on their platform of choice. Nice. And so we're excited to That's bring nice Diablo of to do. Resurrected to PC and console. Nice. Along with cross progression. And for those of you who are in love with the original and you just wish it worked more seamlessly on modern computers, you can bring back all of that nostalgia exactly as you remember and enjoy the game in its original 2D form. Oh, like that's nice of them remaster. to do. Obviously, there's a lot to talk about. Later today, Diablo speedrunner Mr. Llama will host a roundtable with members of the development team on the dedicated Diablo channel. If you are a Diablo wow, 2 fan, man. I encourage you to take a look. But then when it really, really got down to it, it's like... If we're talking about five characters, wouldn't it just make sense to just make a solid DPS character? I mean, think about it. You have the monk. Okay, that's melee DPS. You get rid of the staff and you replace the fist items with daggers, dual daggers. Then you take the demon hunter. You take away the machine gun crossbows and you just keep the bow. You put them together and then boom, you have the rogue. Booyah! 
called it. <laughs> oh, that makes me so happy. But speaking of happiness, I hope subjecting your ears to that crappy mic quality from my old blue snowball, which is literally sitting in that closet right over there, I hope that didn't ruin your happiness. Oh, man. I put so much thought into that video, too. So much research. I had a whole script and everything right here. Jump cuts are an amazing thing. They're like basic editing because you could be reading a script knowing what you're going to talk about for the next five to ten minutes and people don't even know it because you cut all that shit out. That is exactly what I did because my memory is garbage. Now it really makes me wonder. Who's character number five? Is it the paladin slash crusader? Could it be the necromancer? I'm willing to bet money that it's one of those two because who else is left? At this point, who else is left? The Amazon? I doubt that. They're not going to bring back any of the, the other classes from like Diablo 3, like the Witch Doctor, anything like that. No, they're not going to bring any of that back. It has to be one of those two. It has to be. Comment which one you think would get that fifth slot. And if you don't think it's either of them, bring up a class that you would like to see. I'm curious. Because, oh man, if I wasn't hyped enough, I am super hyped now, and I shouldn't be because I'm going to have to go to bed soon. I have doomed myself for the night, but I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you did, why not leave the video a like? Let me know what you think down in the comments below, and if you haven't already, why not consider subscribing? Hit that notification bell so you, yeah you, don't miss any more of this mayhem. Until next time, I appreciate all of you for watching. Like and subscribe for more, for I will continue to make these videos for many moons. Stay safe out there, and never forget to holla at your bear. Peace out.